Hi, I'm Rob the Accountant, and here we go again. All right, today uh, it's about Joe versus Joe. Representative Joe Morelli versus President Joe Biden versus Representative Hakeem Jeffries. You know, first, I, I don't really have many problems with Hakeem Jeffries. I really liked his brutal takedown of uh, Supreme Court Clarence uh, jo- Thomas's wife. I thought that was pretty good. Uh, but, you know... He tends to be more of an orator. And you know what? They like him in New York City. I'm not sure we like him up here. But our guy up here is Representative Joe Morelli. Joe Morelli likes to go uh, to very prominent schools, specifically RIT, one of the, uh, I think he's second to MIT, uh, technical school in the country. And uh, what he does is he gets faculty, specifically black faculty, that he doesn't like when they say something. And they didn't really even say something. They just were speaking to the media. But this guy... He took his time, yep, a representative of Congress, Joe Morelli, took his time to get a black woman fired from her job from a college. Think about that. Hmm. A representative from Congress took his time, not to represent his people, but to try to get people fired. Now, what does this all come down to? You know, I I don't really like loyalty checks, but if we're going to do a loyalty check, let's do a loyalty check for America. I am so tired of it. From Trump's cabinet to Joe Biden's, at least his cabinet's strong, right? Like everybody around him, I mean, even Pete Buttigieg, they're all defending him. But listen, it's easy to jump on the bandwagon or the train when it's leaving, okay? It's getting on when, you know, it was a year ago and everybody saw this coming. Everybody knew. Representative Joe Morelli knew. Representative Harkin Jeffries knew. Everybody in the Democratic Party knew. AOC knew. Everybody knew. But you know what? You guys are all making so much money. It didn't matter. But now, but now it's threatened. You're really starting to see that the writing's on the wall. But what I call all of you is you're all sellouts. You know, either support your guy or don't support your guy. You know, I, 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 don't, I don't know what this world is. I mean, hey, listen, I, you know, one of my famous statements today is, Um, If anyone knows, and there's some people who know because there's some people on YouTube who are still around because of this era. But, you know, John Gotti would be rolling around in his grave. The way the system has flipped, what was used to be illegal is now controlled by the state. We have a bunch of people who spend their time putting money in their pocket. And when everything looks good, they're riding along the train. You know, you know, all of Trump's cabinet, I can't stand any of them. I couldn't stand them when they were in office, but I hate them more now. Yes, I said that. I hate them more now. You don't go work for somebody, take his money for four years, support him that whole position, and then come in when he's down and kick him again. Joe Morelli, you're kicking Joe Biden when he's down. Representative Harkeem Jeffries, you're kicking Joe Biden when he's down. And AOC, I don't, I don't know. You're kicking everybody in America down. I don't know what you're doing. But what I'm trying to say is you, the loyalty check has to be for America. I, I, this really is. If, if, if you are going to do anything in this world for your future and voting for people who care about you, force them to be loyal to the Constitution. Force them to be loyal to you. And if they don't do what they said they were going to do when you sent them to Congress, vote them out. Don't give them another chance. You know, all these people, when they go, they get a pension. They get health care. I think the the salary is $182,000. What are you making that? Right? So who cares? We all know about Joe Biden. But the last person in the world who should be asking for Joe Biden to resign is Representative Joe Morelli when you took the time to try to go get a black woman fired from a prestigious college who didn't even say anything about you. She just she was going to talk to the press. And Representative Harkeem Jeffries' speeches are great. Love him all day long. But nobody up here goes to New York City because you're down there controlling New York City, okay? It just It's not the same city anymore. But that's for you people down there. We're six hours away from you. We don't have to deal with it. And lastly, AOC. Man, I don't know if you're Spanish. I don't know if you're Puerto Rican. But whatever you are, just, just start doing your job. All of you, just start doing your job. Everyone just needs to go do their job like the rest of America does every Monday when they get up at 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9 and go to work. It's time for you people to reach in your pocket and start paying us. 
I'm Rob the Accountant. It's been a great Monday and out the week. We just beginning. Talk to you soon. Have a good day.